I like the fact that in Dublin is getting such a high number of people together. I don't know what the attendance was, but as I was looking down from the podium today, it was pretty full. Um, and I think that the industry in Ireland at, at, at the moment, I think, is on the cusp of something. Um, from a skills perspective in the digital sector, Ireland has come on leaps and bounds in the last three or four years. Plenty innovation, loads of companies doing loads of different things. And from our perspective then today, what we wanted to do was present um, a new approach to potentially designing a website. I'm excited to be here uh, in, in Dublin, uh, my hometown. It's obviously uh, you know, a, a great honour for uh, to come back and speak at uh, this digital summit here. Um, it seems to be growing every year and it's an exciting place. There's a lot of really smart people uh, rallying around. I think digital in Ireland is um, really on the rise. Uh, a lot of smart things happening here. There's a very sort of strong startup culture. So I think it's really, it's a good time to be here and attend the summit. MRY is a uh, creative and technology agency uh, based in New York. Um, our purpose in the world really today is to help brands be remarkable. And what we mean by that really is that in this sort of ever-changing sort of media landscape, it's important that you have big, strong, creative ideas that are supported by technology and then turbocharged by social. I think the key learnings that people are going to take from today are they will understand that they can get so much more from their, from their media dollars, right, by sort of looking at the kind of around the, the outskirts of traditional media plans. There's so much more that you can do, whether it's in search, whether it's in social, whether it's in event marketing and planning and things like that. I think for too long we've been thinking about our advertising dollars in very traditional forms. And there's a lot more you can do from that. I'm actually talking about getting physical, and getting physical is all about how digital and physical installations and experiences are a really big part of what all of us do. And businesses that aren't thinking about the challenges of what that means need to jump on board and start to think about that. Um, everyone knows that digital is a, is, is a really key part of marketing, but how we take that to the next level and bring digital and experiences to that, which is something that customers always enjoy engaging with, um, and making sure businesses understand that value. Clearly, even a year ago, we wouldn't have been talking about things like digital installations and tablets. Um, today, almost everyone is ubiquitous in their use of tablets, mobile devices, other touch experiences that, they've, that they interact with on a daily basis. So, I, I think it's all about making sure that, uh, that, that people are aware of what new technologies and opportunities are out there. Um, so there are differences between, between, the, uh, between maybe the UK and Ireland, but I don't think those are actually the important things. It's all about knowing what's available and how we can best use it in any marketplace. Speaking at an event like this gives me an opportunity to speak to a much wider audience to sow the seeds of the f forward thinking, uh, not to be always in a reactional mode. Uh, too many people are reacting instead of being proactive in uh, their approach to, to understanding the, the uh, structural foundations that are required for digital technologies. The next decade is going to be absolutely mind-blowing uh, with the challenges that it offers businesses. Businesses have been dealing with digital uh, very much at the marketing pro project level. Uh, they need to use and to start thinking of digital as a, as a strategic program level um, facilitator. I think it's interesting to look at the way the conversation has developed. Uh, I think over the last couple of years it's developed an awful lot from the types of metrics that we talk about when we're talking about results for brands, that we're no longer just in a, in a world where people are going, well, I have this many Facebook fans, or I have this many likes on, uh, or I have this many likes on Facebook, I have this many followers on Twitter, you know, where we're much more now drilling into things like r return on investment for brands, where we're drilling much more down into the data sets that we get back from, from brands, from users, from a whole bunch of different people. So I think we're starting to become more precise, we're starting to become a little bit more scientific with the way that we talk to people and, um, and engage with people. And it's interesting to, to watch that develop. So that's, that's been one big part of it. And I think the other, I think, major change that, that, that we've seen in, in the last 12 months is a lot of the conversations here today revolved a lot more around mobile and tablets than even this time 12 months ago. So it just shows the importance of iOS, Android, and, and all of the other platforms that are out there. 
I think it's a great way of getting everybody together um, who's active in the digital marketing space um, in Ireland. Ireland is a relatively small country and it's great for everyone to get together and really meet each other and network and learn about other areas of digital marketing because most people focus on one specific area. Mine is in mobile marketing and I've learned so much already today about you know social, about data, about data protection issues. Uh, there's so much here to learn today so, so it's great to be here. I think it's fantastic. Um, there's an awful lot of stuff I've learned today. The industry people that have spoken have done it very well um, and I think they've put across all the points that are coming up and new changes which is fantastic to know what's happening. The SEO changes will be a massive thing um, especially because the search changes are different and the content is king especially for our website for a 60 brand shopping centre we need to have our website as number one. There's a great selection of speakers, very varied, um, all obviously in the digital sphere, but there's a good selection of opinions and uh, backgrounds. It's a great networking event, um, it's good to gauge the temperature of where we are in the industry, and also really importantly to see what other people are doing, um, best practice, inspiration really as well is, is one of the benefits for me.